Hi everyone, Great Power 60 here. Um, so, tackle the bathroom. I have brought in all of my makeup stuff, my bins, everything, and brought it into my bathroom. And I'm going to turn the fan on, so I hope it's not going to be too noisy, to show you how I have to declutter. Uh, I'm going to show you the before because it's pretty awful and I had to put everything in there. We're going to try and use um, the KonMari um, method of cleaning, which means you take everything out, you put it all together, you touch every one. If you like it, you keep it. If it makes you feel joy or good, you keep it. If it does nothing for you, you get rid of it. I've already done that with my clothes and now to hit the bathroom. So I'm going to turn this around. The fan's going to go on, so I apologize if the audio is a little off so let's have a look we're going to turn it around here and lights on so I have a very small bathroom sort of go up the top first sorry all right so this is my vanity hello that's me <laughs> um, this is all that I have in here it's pretty much organized uh, here I had to do that when I first moved in so as you can see I've always got to have makeup bags here I've got extra things here I've got my mirror and soap and brushes in this makeup in here too much stuff on here and then these are my bins these are things that I had stored there's some more stuff there in my other bathroom in my other place I had room for this little I don't know if you can see it very well here I'll get down and see and show you and I just whoops thrown things on here that were bathroom related so I don't think I'll be able to keep that little stand because um, there's no room in here not really um, unless I can come up with something very creative I don't think you'll be able to see in here, but I'm going to try. Yeah, I guess it's not too bad. And that's my messy under part. Got blow dryers and hair products in the back, in the front here. A few of my other things. Makeup brushes, extra this and that and so on. So this is the before. Oh my goodness. This is the before. Got to get up off my knees. <laughs> this old lady is having trouble alrighty this is the before I'm going to show you the during I'm going to stop now pull everything out I'm going to pr pull it out into my hallway everything out of the bathroom and we'll try her method you can come along with me and we'll see how that goes so I'll be right back I'm going to stop my video now okay I had to change my shirt because it was too much work and uh, it was really cold out today so I had a bit of a sweater on so now I've just got an old t-shirt on to finish doing and I wanted to show you what I've done so far and what I have to do next so the bathroom is completely empty I have the washcloth in there I gotta wash everything down nothing left no cleaning supplies no toilet brush the only thing i've left is my house coat that i wear when i come out of the shower and this cute container it's it's one of those hanging um things that you can put in your closet but i use it in the bathroom but i haven't used it yet i haven't had a chance but i love all these little pockets so and that is behind my door so i'm going to leave that big bulky thing it's the only one i have because i don't wear them and then this out in my hallway cleaning stuff for the toilet all everything every single thing including decoration everything is out of my bathroom I haven't sorted them yet I just brought it all out I got another container because it was easier to move everything with a container than do one or two things at a time and throw it on the floor so I thought this was easier okay so now whew, 
my goodness I'm going to clean my bathroom spotless it shouldn't take long because it's pretty clean um, except for you know cat hair uh, so I'm just gonna clean that up and I will get on the floor and bring you with me and we'll go through this and organize it um, and work from there see you in a bit well I uh, emptied all the containers and try to put them in categories um, the only thing I took out of here was, I don't know if you can see it in my bathroom, but anyway, was the um, decoration thing, the green reeds uh, thing that I wanted on my bath, uh, on my toilet. So, I'll show you what I have here, and we'll try and take you through it without being too stupid here. Okay. So this is all my, that was on, it should be on my uh, vanity, um, my hand soap, so my mirror, I've got my, <sighs> all my hair products are here, anything to do with my hair, curlers, when my hair was longer, I used to put them in curlers, um, I got a couple of hair clips, um, all of these are brushes and blow dryer and curling iron and flat iron, etc., those are empty that's what was underneath i have got three bags of little cotton balls oh my god and some of these hair products oh uh, get rid of it whatever box of q-tips these are empty um, pill box containers that my daughter-in-law and my my grandson has to take pills a lot and these I don't know why she kept them all these years but anyway I'm I'm using them for putting small craft items in and label it as well as nails and screws and little odds and ends of hardware things and as you can see I haven't finished taking all of that off but there's the larger ones and some of the smaller ones and I think they'll come in handy for that rather than going out and buying and they're kind of a pretty color they're green I'm going to put them over there because that goes with the crafts hooks that goes in with the utilities as well cleaning cloth goes in with that as well brush for painting brush for taking fuzz off cat hair off your clothes does not go here a cleaning pad for my Swiffer or not yeah it's my for my Swiffer goes with the cleaning supplies I haven't emptied this my grandson's shoe I mean this was when he was a baby Ugh. over there this is a doggy poop bag probably was in my pants pocket or my sweater pocket when I was getting undressed and I put it in my little rack there that I had in the bathroom that will go with his stuff anyway this is odds and ends I haven't really gone through it I went through all the other boxes but that one this is this is all um, like body care. I've got baby powder, hand cream, baby oil, and these are foot products. This is a big thing of Epsom salts, which is great for a bath when you need to relax. I found this. This is, can, is it focusing? I hope so. Anyway, it says melatonin sleep cream. This was from my uncle's stash of crap that he had ordered. I have no idea if this thing works. I don't know how long he's had it. I don't know. Garbage. Um, this is a uh, vaporizing cold rub. So it's like, it's like um, vapor, vapor rub and all of those other ones that's for colds and stuff so that also stays with the oh 
with all the pills and all the medicine stuff that I have. So I'm going to be organizing that. This, my aunt bought me a long time ago. We'll get rid of that in a bit. But I just wanted to show you my section. So this, you know, sign your tab stuff. You know, cream for whatever. I'll be going through these, not with you, because it's just going to take too long. Medicines here. This is stuff I haven't taken for years. It's probably very old. Sorry. Anyway. Blah, blah, blah. This is a first aid kit my uncle had at his place. And then this is all the makeup that I have to go through. So I'm not going to. I thought maybe I would take you. But you know what? It would take too long. I thought I was going to take you on the journey with me. To sort through keep and not keep but you know what that's that's going to be way too long um, and it is kind of a tedious thing and I'm sure you don't want to see that oh <sighs> okay so I turned my machine off by mistake here as, as I was turning it around so I'm gonna go through all of this and sort it out and put it in uh, containers if it needs containers um, throw out what needs to be thrown out and I'll show you the end result be back in a flash okay what a mess I am um, okay so I'm going to show you what I've done and the only thing I have left to go through is my makeup and I thought I had more than that but I think when I was decluttering my bedroom I threw out a lot of stuff so this is what I've done so far in the bathroom I actually even went through here and at the top there I had medicines in that little clear container up here it's now empty um, this is all my q-tip stuff in there just I may even take that out too and then this is my face stuff and my BB cream etc so on my counter <clears throat> I took all the medicine out and I've put everything in this and this is going in my bedroom in my tall dresser that I have it's like a little cabinet um, that's where I keep my nail products that's also in a bin like this and my cards that I had organized I had done an organization on my all of my different uh, all occasion cards including Christmas birthdays etc so the three of them will fit in there there's no problem so that i'll have my medicine my cards and my nail products in there in bins organized now this is the best i could do for now with what i've got so in the back i went through them and threw out brushes that were not necessary and i have some other ones there my blow dryer and curling iron i don't use my curling iron too much anymore but um, all of this is hair products, um, mousse and hairspray, um, and a few that I just have a little bit left. I'm going to get rid of them as soon as they're done. Of course, my mouthwash is here, my Epsom salts in the back, and this is just the, the extra cotton balls. I put them all in one bag. My Q-tips are in here. I don't really have storage anywhere else for them, so I have to put them there. The baby powder, baby oil basically that's all that's in there i left this down here my kleenex box and my mirror so that i have not too much else in there rather than keep them on my counter um, i always like to have tissue in my bathroom but i have no counter space to put it so i gotta get up again and my mirror can stay in there and this little i just love this thing it's so cute bathroom thing is also going to sit in there and that is the bottom of my cabinet I am not purchasing any bins or any special things for in there that's good enough for me I'm alone so I don't have to worry and I love this in here with the because the theme is seashells and so on it kind of looks like reeds in here and I left that here this is actually a candle in here and this is just those it's rose smelling mm, still smells nice um, 
rose petals that you can use for soap and then my little green carpet and my dustpan or sorry dustbin is actually a garbage bin a little garbage bin that has the same seashell as my curtains in here my shower curtains okay so I've got that all cleared up that was what I was sitting on this is empty still not sure what I'm going to do with that and this is all that is left of organizing and it's just to go through my makeup, throw out what's old, keep what's good. I have a small bin there. I think I'm going to have to use, yes, puppy. Oh, my puppy's here. He says, you've been ignoring me. Um, I got a couple of makeup bags to go through. And so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to organize it by pencils and brushes and makeup and throw out what I don't use there's a lot of perfumes and stuff little ones in there that I don't use I haven't used in years they're probably bad anyway oh so as soon as I'm done that I am done all of my organizing so basically my bathroom is done the makeup uh, will go in a bin in my bedroom along with the nail bin the card bin, the bin that I have in there for medicines. I don't take medicines except, you know, if I have a cold or something or a cut or there's band-aids and so on in there. Basically, that is it. So I am now finished with my bathroom. The makeup, yes, it's not a big deal. I can go through that pretty quickly. Um, some of it is already organized and um, I will leave that in my bedroom. So. Thanks for joining me. I'm sorry this has been a real messy way of, you know, putting my videos together. But uh, unfortunately, my camera doesn't pause. And um, it's just it's just not, not the best camera I have. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching me make an absolute exhausting time of it but my bathroom is spotless now everything is in its place I know where things are and I will get the rest organized so the bedrooms done the linen closets done this closet behind me um, is done bathroom is done but my kitchen was done a while ago I don't need to do that next stop my living room um, and it still has quite a bit of things in there from my uncle's stash that he had. Got to go through those and also go through all of my office supplies. And now that I've been doing some pocket letters and some more crafting, I've got to organize all of that. So we've got sort of three more things to do. Um, craft stuff office supplies and kind of get that organized and the odds and ends of, of things that belong to my uncle that I have to get rid of. Um, I've even got pots. I've got like a coffee, a one cup coffee maker. Um, I'm going to have to donate a lot of this stuff and uh, organize some of his tools that I don't need. If I've already got duplicates, there's no point in keeping those. So. That's my next adventure. Uh, I hope you uh, enjoyed this crazy bathroom decluttering, organizing, and cleaning. And uh, I hope you'll join me again. If you like what you uh, see, please subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. And if you have, hi everyone, welcome back. And uh, we'll see you again in my next organizing, decluttering, purging series. Bye for now.